in because you guys, you know, came up short against the other top teams you guys have played. Is, I mean, is that exciting for you? Oh yeah, another just, chance. I mean, not only playing the lead team, uh, it's exciting to play to get invited to the Outback Bowl. It's not the Rose Bowl, but it's exciting to get invited to a bowl and play a great team like uh, South Carolina. It's going to be a fun time. Do you know anything about South Carolina at this point? Uh, I know they got they got two one backfield, two backfield sets. I mean, they run a lot. It's so, uh, some some similar to Alabama with the power, but uh, I know a little bit about their front. Talk about playing another SEC team and a chance to, you know, they've had their way with the Big Ten the past few years. Can you talk about that and the chance to get another crack at them? Oh, it's just gonna be a big motivator because they have had their way with the Big Ten the last few years. Uh, don't give us a lot to come out there and play our best football. What were the lessons learned last year? I mean, two years ago, obviously, you guys struggled going to the bowl game. Last year, you guys went down and you won. Was there things you learned about doing the way you did it last year? It was a preparation. Um, we took it like last year was for the seniors. This year is for the seniors as well. We went out as hard as we could. We tried to get everything uh, so we could send the seniors home with a win. Yeah. Is there something special about playing on New Year's Day? I know bowl games are all over the place now, you know, for like a month. But does yeah. New Year's Day mean anything to you at all? Uh, no, I mean, it's. I mean, I rather play on New Year's than any other day. I mean, not any other day before New Year's. I mean, because you get more time with your family too from um, bowl preparation. What can you take out of those losses for Ohio State, Notre Dame, and Alabama, and sort of use that against South Carolina? Uh, just use it as motivation. I mean, look at look at back what we did wrong, try to prepare ourselves better. You see, this as kind of maybe redemption. I mean, because you were so close at, against Notre Dame, against mm -hmm. Ohio State, you were right there in the Nebraska as well. Do you see this as kind of a redemption, maybe against the top tier team? Yeah, I mean, you can see it as a redemption game, or just us coming out <laughs> trying to play Michigan football and finish. We preach finish all the time. And that's what we need to do. That's what we didn't do against those teams. Anything that you individually want to do better against uh, them that you didn't do in those, uh, those three games? Uh, probably be a better senior leadership. Try to get the young guys to come along and uh, buy into it. Is some of that involved in getting them hyped up? That you know that this bowl game matters. It's not. It's not the champion. You didn't win the championship, but you know this is still relevant. It still is an important game. Uh, it's more so. Uh, the practice we have coming up, the earlier ones when we don't have the game plan in, getting them to go out, go all out every play, just so they can get the feel. So when I leave, they they will, they won't be talking like I am right now, saying we could have did this, could have did that.